Broadcasting from the business capital of the world, this is the Podcast Business News Network. All right, guys. Hey, welcome back. I got something for, for you guys. As you see, um, usually we'd be on the, the radio part of it, but, but now uh, we have a Zoom um, video with two, uh, uh, two 20-year best friends who created this business together, and uh, they... We have a lot of questions for them. I'm talking about Christy Esser and Cindy Jacobs. Now, Cindy Jacobs happens happens to be a very successful life coach, and she teamed up with Christy, uh, Christy uh, Esser, who happens to be a psychic. So they put their skills together and are really helping people and making a huge difference here. Um, if you need to uh, have any any proof right off the bat. Uh, their kids, their kids are getting married, and um, uh, Christy called that one. Uh, she knew that was going to happen. So as I got a million questions for them. So if you guys want to call in, you can 631-730-7376, or you can use the instant feedback where you just write a question, give me your name, where you're from, and I'll read it to uh, Christy and Cindy, and we'll get their response live on the air. So uh, if you're bashful, just say anonymous, and my producer will read it because I'm blind and I can't see that far so guys with no further ado i um, very excited to welcome to the program christy esser and cindy jacobs hey guys welcome to the show thank you how are you thank you for I'm having doing great. I'm so excited. yeah i mean what a, what a great idea i mean how did this uh idea come about i mean to to, to pull your guys talents together um to, to, to start the business well, I think we, we just realized that we do the same thing. We just do it differently. And when you can draw on the spirit world along with the logic and science world, that's the, you're drawing all three powers together. Gotcha. And, yeah. um, and, uh, and Christy, um, how, how did you feel uh, when you guys were about to take this big plunge into working together i know you guys are best friends but uh, uh, we're super excited we work really well together and we both have an understanding of how each of us think and how all of this works even though she's not psychic she fully understands how it works and where it comes from so between the two of us we can tag team one another and I can help speed up the process for people because I can dig and see what their root problems are psychically. Mm -hmm. And then she can handle And then it. I delve into their mind. Yes. In other words, she can see things from the spirit world that I cannot see. I am not psychic at all. Okay. I have zero okay. ability for that. Okay. Um, I know psychology and mindset and logic and psych, you know, that kind of thing. So when you combine those, it's just, it's amazing what you can do for someone. Yep. It's, I mean, that's, it's, it's such a great idea. Now, can you talk yeah. me through this? Um, I was just telling people a little bit in the beginning, just about, you know, what you do. And I kind of got ahead of myself, but if I could start with, uh, with Cindy, um, mm -hmm. if you had to tell me, if I met you out on the street or something like that and asked you what your business was about, can you tell me, um, just starting from, from the, the start, uh, if nobody knew anything about you, um, I know yeah. that you're, you're a life coach, but tell me, um, you, you know, how uh, you would explain to me what, what you guys do. And then, I, then I'll, I'll go over to Christy. I would say that I'm an elite, elite level mind coach, mindset coach. I'm a PGI consultant, which just means Proctor Gallagher and consultant. If and you've ever heard that? Bob Proctor, have you ever heard of Bob Proctor from The Secret? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Bob Proctor is my mentor. Okay. Oh. I'm one of his consultants. Oh, okay. So Bob for the past 60 years has been, has been learning about the mind and how it works with the body. So I have learned from him. So it's, it's a proven course. It's a proven program where we take logic and science and psychology and we unlock people's potential. There are millions of people in this world. And I think it's one of the saddest things for this country that are they're settling. They're in jobs that they don't like, they don't enjoy. They have so much potential to make more, do more, be more, but they don't know how to go about it. So if, I just want to say to people, like, stop the struggle, stop wasting time, stop trying to figure it out. You're living from the outside in instead of living from the inside out and taking control of your life. 
So, so I can sit with someone and I can ask them some questions. Where are you? Where do you want to go? And literally in one phone call, I can tell you why you're stuck, why you're wow. not there, what you're doing wrong wow. and how to go about it and just change your life. That's change awesome. Life. That's awesome. Um, so, um, now, Kristen, now, um, what do you, what do you uh, bring to the table? I know there's, there's a, a whole lot of things and uh, let me, let me just give you the ball. Okay, so my role is to teach people that there is life on the other side and your loved ones who have passed are always with you and communicate through you're always sending you signs and things that you're supposed to be aware of to keep on your path. I'm just a tool that they use for me to help guide them and for them to understand the things that they harbor as uh, difficulties in their life. And I am able to weed through that for them. So Cindy can do it on the logical sense, but I can help them speed up the process because I can tell them what exactly is going on with them. When did you know uh, at, that you had this gift? Were you a kid or? I think I've always had it, but it really opened up in the past like three years. And like I said, like you said in the beginning of the show that, um, we never introduced our children. We always kept it separate. We never had play dates. We've been friends since we were 18 or 19 years old. Yeah. That's and then awesome. one day, That's one day crazy. my daughter's like, they, they broke up. She broke up with her boyfriend. And I said, Cindy, is Sean single? She's like, yes. Yeah. And I'm like, what do you think about introducing them? And I thought, what? I've never even thought about them having an interest in each other or even it never it never entered our minds to introduce our children never. it's crazy and the minute she said <laughs> oh, the minute she said okay let's do it i said cindy it's going to be love at first sight and they're going to get married i, I knew was it, like, knew no. it with every fiber of my soul and their wedding is scheduled for next october oh god that is that i, I was gonna <laughs> ask you to 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 get into that story but that's just incredible i mean yeah. before never they even met, met and you said this is yep. what's gonna happen Yep. Wow. Mm -hmm. so, we were so having I, a conversation and she said, I see hearts. I see hearts. I see love. <laughs> and I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm wow. like, I start warning her. I'm like, oh, you don't know my son. <laughs> uh, I'm worried about Lexi. <laughs> <laughs> so cool, guys. So now, now take me through it. Say I am a, a potential client. What happens mm -hmm. first? Uh, do I get on that call um, with, uh, with, um, with Cindy first, do I, do I talk to you first about the, the life coaching? How does it work? I'm a new client. I'm interested. I'm going to go to, where do I go to uh, website? You can start with either one. You can, we both have business Facebook pages, so you can go to either Facebook page and start with either one. And what we'll do is we'll go through a list of questions with you and we'll determine, you know, what course is best for you. Like, how are you going to best benefit from our service? Okay. And maybe more, you maybe like, you know, maybe you really believe in the spirit world and, and you want that guidance from psychics. Maybe then you start with Christy and I would send you over to Christy yeah. and, then, you know, or if, you know, it just depends on what it is you need, but we would figure that out. For yeah. You. And then help. between the both of us, we can figure out exactly what's happening, what's blocking them, what's stuck in their paradigms and we can dissect it. Yes. What's. And so do you do the initial call to uh, Christy? You'll, you'll do, um, I don't know what they call it. Is it like a consultation? With is me, that what it is? The, fir the first call, is that called like a consultation? Because not everyone's going to be a fit, right? Well, for me, it's called a discovery call. Discovery, okay. Let's discover, you know, where are you? Where do you want to be? What's blocking you? Where are you stuck? You know, are you someone that has a business and you want to build that business, but you have no idea how to do it? Do you want to start a business? Do you need a relationship? Are you stuck in a bad one? You know, is it your health? Is it your fitness? So I can help in all areas with your mind. I'm going to okay. go, I'm going to, it's going to be a deep dive into the mind and the psychology behind it, where if, and if you want the spiritual side of it, then me, you would have a reading from Christy. For me, I know nothing about them. When my clients come to me. I don't even want to know their name. I want to know nothing she about knows them. Nothing about them when they call, even when they call, please don't tell me your name. Please don't tell me anything about your life. Don't, don't feed me information. That's my job. I tell you. Wow. So they come in cold Turkey and then I, run with whatever the, I say they tell me to say I'm just the messenger 
So but I, they, I give very, they give me very specific, very valid, very clear information, names, circumstances, you name it. Okay. So how much of the, of the, uh, the partnership here is working one-on-one -on -one with clients? Uh, or do you, is it a bunch of people in, in, in a course at, at a, you know, at, on a Zoom a classroom or something like that? Or is it all one-on-one? -on -one? How does it work, guys? And, and let, me, let me go with uh, Cindy. Well, for me, it can be both ways. Some people want the one-on-one -on -one attention. They really want to dive deep into like personal things. Um, and I could certainly accommodate a one-on-one -on -one, uh, program. And then other people, they're in, they're in a course and they're with, they're with a group, like a Zoom group, you know, a Zoom course. Um, so I, I'm, I accommodate either way. Some people are very private and want one-on-one -on -one attention. Other people are more in a classroom setting. Uh -huh. And how long do these so, courses last? For me, my program is 12 lessons. So it depends on the, on the client. The client might want to do one lesson a week, which would mean 12 weeks. And you can certainly learn everything I want to teach you in 12 weeks. Other people, they want to do one lesson every couple of weeks and it might take them six months. So I would say between three and six months for my, for, for my program. Okay. But and Christy, Christy I, I would think that you do a lot more one-on-ones, um, yes. right? Tell me I, about I have, that. I have done group, but what happens like, I'm going to compare myself to any other medium, like the Long Island medium, whenever she's in a group of people, it, the information bounces and you got to figure out who you're talking about. So I, I can do that, but I like it to be one-on-one because -on -one I could just focus on that person because if everybody's in the room, the other side, they don't care who's there. They just want their loved ones to be heard. You know, they want to know, they want the information to be told. And then you got to decide who you who who you're talking to you know what i mean like mm -hmm. who in the room that the information pertains to i got um, you but yeah one on one is definitely best for me <laughs> okay and guys as, i'm sorry go ahead no i was just going to say that um for me it doesn't go on week after week i they have to give it time in between it's like for me you got to wait till the next chapter your book your life is like a book and you have to wait for that next chapter to happen before I can give you more information. And I tell people, you can't be addicted to this either. There has to be something happening in your life that I can, you know, pick up on. Gotcha. And, and um, can you guys, uh, uh, and Christy, let me start with you. Can you tell me, uh, you said Facebook page, but is there a website that people should go to or what? I'm not tech savvy. <laughs> I just have a Facebook page. Okay, so just go to the Facebook page and get in touch with you that way. Yes, yes, I okay. yes, I have all my information. <laughs> all right, Cindy, same way. Yeah, so I have a, uh, you can reach me at my personal Facebook or my business. So personal is a Cindy Jacobs, and I spell it C Y N D I, and then Jacobs. Or my business is Starry Life Consulting, and that you can find that on on uh, Facebook. Okay, great. Hey guys, there's a bunch of people that have written in and want to ask you questions, but before we get to them, I got to ask you one each. Can you tell me and the audience, uh, I'm, I'm going to start with, uh, with Cindy, uh, one person that you worked with, I see how passionate you guys are, but one person yeah. that you worked with and you saw the light turn on and this is a great example of what you do and you were able to, to help them out. Can you tell me one, one story about uh, a client? Yeah, I mean, I had a client who, you know, was going through a time in her life, you know, in her 50s, like all women our age where we're feeling like heavier and older and just uh, like, just not feeling good about herself going through, you know, that change of lifetime time. And she's, oh my gosh, within a couple of weeks, she dropped nine pounds. She's on track. She's thinking completely different. She's yeah. not thinking I'm old, life is over, you know, <laughs> like, come on, you're still young, you're beautiful. Yeah, menopause. <laughs> yeah. um, and then, you know, another client who within two weeks of working with me, their business took off, like their business was going along. Okay. But just okay. And then bam, like, like I told, I told her, you're going to need help, <laughs> get an assistant, get help because you're not going to be able to handle it. But bam, can't even handle the business. That's wow. like yeah. universal laws. O over the, over the top. I, yeah, yeah I, use, I use universal laws and science to, to get your mind set like you're you're full of so much potential you have no idea what you're capable of that's awesome such positive stuff and christy can you tell yeah. me a, a couple stories a story or two about 
Somebody oh, that's she has you, a million. You, you she has a million stories. Okay, so I'll start, I'll start with my husband. Oh, geez. Okay, so when I first met him, I knew nothing about him, although we went to high school together, but we knew of each other, but we never hung out. So I said, your father, he passed away. And he's like, yep. And I said, cancer? And he's like, uh-huh. I said, did he hide money all over the backyard? And you had to go on like this treasure like hunt? buried money. Buried money. Oh and my God, how do you know that? Right. He said, Wait, it gets better, it gets better. And I said, um, was there like, and I gave him X amount of dollars and he's like, you nailed it. And I said, but you didn't find it all. He's like, what are you talking about? It was a Sunday night, okay? And we had our high school reunion coming up and I'm like, oh my gosh, if I don't nail this, he's gonna tell everybody I'm crazy. <laughs> and I said, you didn't find it all. He's like, what are you talking about? I said, you have to call the state treasury department tomorrow. There is money in your name that you didn't find. And wow. The Pennsylvania State Treasury Department. There was lost, Who would think of that? There was lost money. Here, there was all this money for him in the Treasury Department waiting for him to call and, and claim it. Yep. Wow. That, and, and, and how much money <laughs> it was? You didn't find it all? That is incredible. My God. It, it, so, was, so, it, was, it was a chunk of change, too. <laughs> nice. Good for you guys. <laughs> I, bet you, I bet that was a, a nice thing to find. Hey, let me go over. Mr. Producer's got some uh, some people that are writing and want to ask you some questions. Awesome. Yeah, so we have Thomas from Nevada. And um, he goes, you guys are living every best friend's dream, starting a business with your uh -huh. best friend. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And having your children fall in love with each other and officially becoming right. family. Yeah. We're blessed. We're blessed. Thank Onward. You Thank, um, you, Thank you, Tom. Thank you, Thomas. <laughs> Um, we have uh, Tim from Florida. Um, do you think being best friends give you guys an edge on other life coaches and spiritual healers because you guys work together? That's a good question. I, I absolutely do because not only do we know and understand each other, we just have that energy between us that you can't describe. Yeah. You know, and we're kind of opposites in a way. Yeah, we're total opposites. And <laughs> for some reason, it just works. We, I ground her. She she makes me laugh. Yeah. I mean, you know, like we just feed off each other. And like that, our we, energies. We've you know? been through so much um, together. And we've been through everything together. And our lives have been so parallel that crazy. Yeah. It, it, it's it's just like there's just you can't even make this stuff no. up. Right. But we right. Through. How this would end up like this. This is yeah. pretty Never. amazing. We had we had awesome. no idea that the, any <laughs> of this would ever happen. Mr. Producer, we got time for another one. Yes, we okay. have um, Timothy from Virginia. They go, how long have you guys uh, been working together? Well, let's see. We've been friends since 18. We actually worked together back then. Yeah. Um, Doing what? We were hairdressers. <laughs> okay. We used right. to, like, right in high school, we were hairdressers. for this. Okay. That's how we met. Yeah. Um, then, of course, we stopped. We, we, we kind of went into our lives having children, raising children. Um, and then about four years ago, everything changed. Everything. We both went through a traumatic <laughs> life situation. We were getting divorced. Oh, okay. <laughs> at the same time. At the same, at the same time. time. Wow. Yeah. Very tragic stories. And it was very heartbreaking for us both. But we were able to lean on each other. Yeah. And we realized, you know what? Like, my gosh, we would, we would be talking and three hours would go by. Yeah. And we're like. It felt like 20 minutes, yeah. you know, <laughs> and we're just like, oh my gosh, like we need to like, what we were, what we've realized, what we've gone through together and like, and what you do and what I do, we could be helping people. Yep. We through need our, to work together. Through with our us. own circumstances and things that we've learned and in our, and in our backing of what we do through our own experiences, we feel we can help people more because we've been there. We've been, we've been there. through everything. Right. I feel like been through everything possible. literally right yeah. right yeah no uh that that is uh, everything is just more remarkable than the next uh mr <laughs> producer what else are people saying we have gina from georgia um and she goes i'm sure as friends you guys have learned a lot from each other over the years but what have you guys learned from each other through your professions that you guys have merged together mm, good question well at any given time, all of us are working on three planes. So yeah. We're working on the spirit plane, the mind plane, and the body plane. So the mental, the physical, and the spiritual plane. 
And what I realized is, you know, she has that spiritual plane part that I, that I don't bring to the table. I mean, I understand how the mind, the mind, body and, and spirit work together, but she really has that intuition that I don't have. Well, and you have it. I have <laughs> it, but she's really, she's overdeveloped it. And I have to work on developing that a little bit more because I'm just so logical and psychological. That's, a, I go that's probably why it works so well. Cause it's, yeah, I believe it's, in science and like the laws of the universe and, and that mm-hmm. kind of thing. Let's, let's, let's marry the two. Let's bring it together and, and I, give people the best possible experience. And I'm actually taking her course with her. She's training I'm, me. I'm training her. She's in my Great program. Yes. Like you're Great joining idea. my program. Yes. <laughs> so I have to do the homework. <laughs> <laughs> so, so I know you guys are at the top of your game and you're in, in much demand. Are you taking new clients right now? Yes. Yes, you are. are. Okay, all- great. Oh, yes, yes. Great. And, yes. and uh, again, just people go to, to Facebook and um, they, they, they just they, they look up um, uh, Christy um, uh, Esser and uh, yes. Cindy Jacobs, and uh, it will lead one, you know, if, if you get a hold of Christy, then, you know, it doesn't can, matter. Yeah. Right, it's right. It's, it's the same thing. Up. Okay, cool. <laughs> <Mr. Producer. laughs> well, you know what I mean? It's, it's, the, it's the same, it's the same place to, to get the to get yeah. involved. Uh-huh. Mr. Pedersen, yeah. what you got, man? Um, we have Rose from Maryland, and she goes, you guys are definitely a dynamic duo. Whose idea Aww. was it to join forces? <laughs> oh, whose idea was it? I, I think she was the driver. Yeah, I think Christy drove it. Yeah. yeah I'm was... always the ringleader for whatever reason. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she... I have to, like, pull her in. Come on, Cindy, yeah. we're doing this. <laughs> she's got to rope me into things. <laughs> oh, um, but thank you for your question. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Hope Ms. you don't Mr. mind us drinking. Oh, no, no. Just, it's, hey, I, 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 I encourage it. A little wine it. doesn't help, you know. It doesn't hurt. Um, Mr. Producer, we got time for one more? Yes. Okay. We have um, Sydney from Delaware. Um, she goes. Hey. From Delaware. I, awesome. Yes. I don't want to sound like a creep, but these <gasps> two women are some beautiful women. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah, everybody can see that. It's, that's Come on. awesome. Thank the you. age doesn't matter, y'all. Yeah. Women out there in your 50s, we can still rock it, okay? <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Um, so uh, tell me what um, you guys have, uh, when is the next course starting and uh, what's going on for the holidays? Anything special? What What's going on? Let me start with Christy. Um, well, I can take people on call. So I'm a little bit different than Cindy. I will do my best to um, work you around- into your busy schedule. Yeah. You got a busy schedule. Right, so but I will do there. my best to work around somebody's schedule. <clears throat> if I have to work around the clock, I do it. Wow. Cindy? I don't sleep anyway. She really doesn't, doesn't sleep. <laughs> I, don't sleep. <laughs> I don't know how you can survive on three hours a day if that, you know. Wow. I need my sleep. I need my eight hours. You know. I got it. Uh, so uh, when does when does um, your course start, or is it kind of uh, always like yeah, so, you can jump in? Yeah. So basically, um, you either you can email me if you're an email person, starrylifecj at gmail dot com, or you can go to my Facebook, send me a message, say I heard you on Casey's show, and I want to have a discovery call. I want to you know I want to start my best life. And I will call you. The first call is kind of a one-on-one. And then your first lesson will also be one-on-one because I want to really dig in, dive deep with you and what you're, where you are now and where you want to go. What are your needs? What are your wants? And really dive into that. But then you can just, you can just join in. I kind of just put you into a program that's already in progress. Or if you want to do one-on-one, we can do that. Awesome. Uh, And, uh, you guys, I know, uh, help people virtually, but where are you located? Um, I live in Beth- Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. We're Pennsylvania. in Coopersburg, right? We're in Coopersburg right now. We're at okay. my little my stop. All right, but you guys will talk <laughs> about that when people get a hold of you through Facebook or whatever, right? Yeah, um, email me or Facebook. Yep. Okay. Um, last thing I wanted to ask you guys: um, a lot of younger people listen to this show. And yeah. they maybe they don't want to be a psych, maybe they don't want to be a life coach, but they just want to be as successful as you guys. Uh, what type of advice would you give someone younger starting out, just wanting to be as successful as you, maybe not doing the same thing? Do you understand? Uh, so let me, Christy, let me start with you. Start with her. Okay, so 
fear means nothing, okay? You have to break through any type of fear to get to the next level. Um, just don't let anything stop you. Don't let anybody tell you no. You just plow through because somehow, some way, you might fail, but it, it'll push you through to the next level, okay? You just don't stop. You got to keep pushing through. That's that you just can't let people tell you no because we wouldn't be here if we had all the naysayers say we can't do what we're doing. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Good advice. Cindy. I, I mean, it's really sad because, you know, school should teach you what you're capable of, how to use your mind, how to think. And I mean, the truth is most people out there are not thinking, you know, uh, mind activity does not constitute thinking. So what you're doing is you're, you're on social media, you're listening to the news, you're watching shows, you're living from the outside in, and you need to start living from the inside out. You need to start thinking for yourself. What do I want? Um, where do I want to go? You need to set a goal. And believe that you, that you, not only that you can achieve it, but you already are it. You already have everything you need inside of you. So stop looking at to the outside world. Stop listening to what people say. Stop, stop looking at your circumstances. Like don't look at your bank account. Don't look at your bills. Don't look at everything on the outside determining who you are, or where you're going. That means nothing about right. what you, that has nothing to do with your potential. A goal to make you nervous. A goal to make you scared. Yes. If you're not nervous and scared and, and you're jumping out of bed, There's excited no reward for life. At the end. Yeah. And get, get a, you know, you don't have to use me for your coach, but get a mentor, talk to someone that does what you want to do, ask them how they did it, you know, get around people that have a higher level of thinking yeah. and who are doing what you want to do, get, who are already successful, get advice from them. Got and it. give me a call. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, it was a pleasure to meet you. Great, uh, great, uh, great uh, show. And I uh, can't wait to hear what you guys have to say next. And uh, we'll be right back. Thank you so much. Thank guys. you, friend. Thanks, Casey. All right. <laughs>